I, I can see why uh, you are my mechanic. That's right. Tuning up I'm hearts sore. and minds, my friend, <laughs> one at a time, baby. <laughs> you unpacked a lot. You got to the heart of, of what I was, the heart of the issue. Sure, uh, that's what I'm always trying to do. Like you have this this innate ability to be able to meet people where they are, okay? Not where you want them to be or where you expect them to be in 10 years or whatever, but meeting them where they are is more important than speaking through them to where they could be. I'm very skeptical all, all the time. So I'm, I'm every time that I see like Tony Robbins or, or people like that, I'm like, a, yeah, I know he's going to tell me that I am the best and I, I can and I just need to declare it and I will. And I know that and I, I, and I will not. So I, I, I don't get impressed with that. But you, you, you told me something I never heard before and, and, and it really clicked. And, and, and I swear to that, that I, I, it really touched me deeply. Sometimes we're so close to everything that, you know, <laughs> it's difficult to see. You know, that yeah. I, got, I got this stuff around here, you know, all this other stuff. So... That's all I'm trying to do is create the perspective for Tamal yourself. So as I tend to do, I said a lot. How you feeling? What you thinking? I'm so glad I clicked on that link. Welcome everybody to Mind Tune Up Time Live. Super excited to be with all of you today. You know, get their minds rolling in such a way that we can get you guys queued up so you can start asking questions. No, I've, I've gone through that with the job. You know, I've gone at, uh, you know, at points where it's like, I've had it with a stupid layout. I'm done, right? Yep. Just because I wanted to do, I didn't know what I wanted to do. I just wanted my freedom. Well, all these things about people with a lot of money or way more than you have relative to where your situation is, then your identity becomes you need to be poor to be a good person. I don't know what it is, but it's just, the you know, you, you grow, grow up, you hear people say stuff, and then it's just hard to hear sometimes. You had something before you were on here, Maxim, so I'm going to do, do you next here after JJ. Yeah, I just, I just want to to make a point because I have this conversation inside. My sweet spot, my gift, my talent, my zone of genius is being able to hear people and help them. If you won't receive things from people and just be a receiver of things, then there's other areas you're holding back. So when somebody's willing to give you something, you're like, no, 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 I don't want your thing. You're also telling the world you don't want other things. So yeah. we just accept things as much as possible now from anybody who's willing or wanting to give it. Doesn't mean I'm asking all the yeah. time, but go ahead. Willingly give and graciously receive. That's what Bob Proctor always says. There are so many people out there who are still stuck after years of personal development and courses and books and programs and I've been one of those people. So after years of doing this now, I'm owning my gift of being able to untangle one's mind and get in there and give you wisdom and guiding principles and ideas that can get you having what we call click moments. And with these click moments, magic starts to happen and things start to move for you in a way that they've never moved before. So Sam, there we go, Darren's got it, there we go. All right, rock and roll. Rock and roll, love y'all, appreciate you. We'll talk soon, we'll see you on Thursday. Excited to dig in and help you tune up your heart, tune up your mind. Keep rocking, keep rolling, look forward to connecting, and we'll talk soon.